Hello, this is Adam Rayner for Talk Audio TV. Today, I'm at DCS, that's Data Conversion Systems. I'm, uh, well, in the, um, in the Cambridgeshire High Tech Zone. I'm here to learn about excellence in, well, zeros and ones being turned into emotions. Right, well, we're on the way down to go and have a look around the factory. Meanwhile, check out all of the front covers these guys have got. Awards hanging off them, like Captain Kirk has got flipping medals. <laughs> on the way in, rather a lot of awards. These are put on auto test, they can take anywhere from, from four to ten hours to run. If anything fails, the production manager's ping, um, and then it will get past the service. So again, I mean, th this one here, the Valley Transport, you can see we've got, you know, the electronics are isolated from the power supplies. The power supplies are on their own sub chassis. And um, again, the mechanism is, is isolated from everything else. So again, what Ben's doing here is just Do you remember the first Jurassic Park movie? Yes. There was a character in that called Donald Gennaro. Donald Gennaro. He was the uh, he was the accountant. He was. Yeah. Remember the kid who says, "Look, I found these under my seat." He said. Were they heavy? <laughs> yes, and they're expensive, so put them away. <laughs> I can yeah. see that you're handling those big chunks of aluminium that yeah. DCS kit has a massive Donald Gennaro rating. Absolutely, absolutely. Especially like pieces like this. Yeah, so look at the camera. So, yeah. That is, that's, that's a piece of flipping monstrously heavy. Yeah. Is that like card from billet or is it cast in the first place? Or? Uh, well, it's, it's literally, it used to be like a big piece of sort of aluminium that the alloy would be used. Yes. And then it's all machined out, you know, all goes through the process, comes here, gets inspected yes. um, to see if it's, you know, suitable. And then it goes off to be anodized. Once it's been anodized, it comes back here to get inspected. And then we'll get laser sort of so yeah, so etching assume, and assume everything and the um, screen printing involved. Dude. And then yeah, it comes back again. Has anybody ever scratched a finished anodized yeah. panel? Yes. <laughs> that was so cool of me. I was just knew it had to happen. Yes, yeah, cool, cool. You could yeah. lie about it or you could pull that rueful face no, no, and go, it, 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 it always gets found, so you know yeah. it, it goes through a lot of inspection so it gets found. Everything leaves the place perfect. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Yeah. Seventy one steps that these guys need to follow in order to pass it. And that, that's from testing every input, testing the balanced out, the unbalanced out, um, the up sampling. So that's really when you're, you're pressing buttons and you're using it as a user would. You're not doing critical listening, but you are listening for any pops or ticks or um, sh strange things that, that could be happening on, on the output stage. Um, so that's another kind of method of quality control. So we've got the automated tests. Um, again, all those test results are stored. But then you've got the user testing. Um, so that's done here. So we're actually just rebuilding this station so we can have two running in parallel. Again, you know, with Vivaldi, for example, we replaced the network board with a, an upgraded one. So that kind of two-way feedback of, of how that could be done. Um, made things much easier when we did roll it out. So I'll let Andy talk through, he's got hugely expensive test equipment here that does 
things I don't really know about. Um, but they're on the balance sheet, so they must be. and you're just pointing out that you've actually got a badge and yeah. Chris on the uh, left of your picture I just had to ask these gentlemen's names again. Um, guys, you are the right and left hand sides of the effective brain of DCS, as we've just been told upstairs. Apparently so, yes. So, and, uh, you're in charge of the uh, hardware, as the electronics and. I'm in charge of the software. The software, sorry, other way around. Duh. Yeah, the, the, the easy stuff. Side. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and you, sir, are, of course, in charge of. The, the, the hard stuff. The, stuff the difficult goes, stuff. Stuff that goes inside it. Yes, yeah. I guess it's kind of the view that, you know, you wouldn't actually have a car to ride in unless that man painted it for you, though, really. You know, it's like. I don't I like the rustic look. Yeah. You do. <laughs> As long as it's fully in binary, so uh, <laughs> and and you were telling us how many years between you with DCS? Well, I think 14, yeah, you? yeah. You, you're, you've been here 24, did you say? 24, yeah. And I've yeah. been here 19. You so. can see what it's done to your hair, gentlemen. Absolutely, Ab absolutely. absolutely. There probably wasn't a shred of grey on day one, was there? Mm. But, uh, no, it wasn't hey, but it's <laughs> <laughs> well, great to be. Uh, it's yeah. just uh, I always say that. Any company that's really, truly bloody brilliant, as well as all the chaps on the gold face in the background who can hear me and are looking daggers at me slightly, yeah. <laughs> shut up, you fat idiot, is yeah. that you absolutely need the golden geese as well, and that'd be you guys, I think. Uh, is that when you're going to kill us? Uh, <laughs> no, no, just, no, no, I want the golden eggs, and so does the company, and so does DCS geezer. So motored yeah. B for the first point. Cheers. Uh, Thanks ever so much, guys. No, that's, uh, it's just great to find out a bit about what you're doing. Let's go and have a little listen in your fabulous listening room, because I gather that's a bit of an event. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. So, thank you. Guys. Did you say we had to write it down? Yeah. Oh, so we've got those special paint finishes. Oh, we're in the listening room now. So yeah, this is the Vivaldi one in the standard anodized finish. Um, so you saw the white in the back right there. Violently expensive standard our speakers. Standard the transport. The beautiful, purpose-built listening room. <coughs> Are you okay to dim those lights? Yes, dear boy, thank you. All right. So first thing I'm going to play is just something from Tidal. Um, pop piece. You've probably heard it. That's my visit to uh, DCS today. I can tell you that having sat in that listening room, the sheer quality of that massive pair of Wilson speakers was breathtaking. And the sound of the uh, front end, incredible. Even on a bit of MP3, the future is here and now, and it's definitely, uh, definitely digital streaming. DCS, only music.